When you're eating late, what's on your plate when you're on a date? It's Aquafia's delicious homemade pound mm, cake. And we are right. here today. I'm Orphea Elias Torella Adams Taylor, President and CEO of Orphea's Pound Cake Company. And the history is my mother used to make these cakes. And she made them for her family and friends, and she had customers too. Okay. Uh, she'd make whole ones. And she made me learn this cake when I was go right before I went to college. And I said, I'm not making no cake. I'm, I'm going to college. I got three degrees. <laughs> and my dad said, you know what? You, it's okay. You learn this cake. She said, by heart. So it's not written down. Two wow. people have asked her for the recipe. She said, listen, I just gave them some recipe out of the book. Aww. She said, you're the only one, because I'm an only child. They had three miscarriages before I was born. So I count myself a blessing for okay. being here. And uh, so I did learn it. I went on to college. And then she, she kept making her cakes. and. Uh, she never, she would never dream that it would have been like this. Right. And so she passed away, and uh, at the time I was working at a university, and the first day back, I stopped to get my coffee where I always get it from, and God had some cake there. I usually get a corn muffin, because you know I like it real buttery, and, mm -hmm. and you know, like <laughs> jelly and one and everything. And I said, I don't have time for that. My first day back after three weeks. I mean, so I went and uh, <laughs> I grabbed a slice of cake, and I, you know how you talk out loud? This cake doesn't taste good. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know this cake tastes good. Yes, like, right? They go in line to the guy behind. We, yeah, we call him uh, Mignana. He said, you talk about my cake in front of my customers. They're not going to buy. Why would you say? I said, oh, I didn't know I was talking loud. He said, your mother make a better cake than this. I want you to bring her slice. Let me taste it. I, I said, well, she passed away. He said, can't you make it? I said, yeah, but I don't do that. He said, yes, you do, you know. But it took a while, it was a while. And our business started in 2006, and his his truck, his and another Islamic truck was the first two trucks that started selling our cake. And it just went on from there. We got a contract, and I went to full time. And it's in supermarkets uh, uh, throughout uh, Delaware, New Jersey. We have a list of stores. Um, I have some cousins, my Adam's cousins. Uh, in South Carolina, they're working on it because they want it down there, and I have another cousin that's going to be the point person when I send it down there to her. Um, sure. So that's, you know, it's, it's a blessing. So we've been in business for about 12 years, and I know my mother, my aunt said, she's out there smiling, said she laughing, because didn't I say? <laughs> no, 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 no. So, oh, we, have, we do have the staff. Um, my two daughters are, are the only ones that know the recipe, and we... Um, they know by heart too. We didn't write it down. Awesome, I love but it. But people were asking. They were saying, "I hope, I hope that recipe didn't go on the ground." But they said they didn't want to say nothing to me because I just came back to work. But it was funny how the man and I, I you know, I do talk out loud when I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. But that time people were looking too, and I was like, "Oh no!" So we here we are. Uh, we have seasonal flavors. These are original butter today. Well, uh, yesterday was the ending of our um, pumpkin spice. We, we do Why that. did you do it? You just did it. No. That's my favorite. I know. You loved it. We make it fun. We, you know, even when I used to work at the university as an administrator, and I um, always, I did workshops from time to time, but that was part of my job. I made it fun. Right. You know, a lot of fun. So what we did was we um, started with different flavors, like we had chocolate chip, and we had banana that came back three times. Classic Caramel. We're in uh, Williams Sonoma. We got some surprises. We're going back to Williams Sonoma. We're in all of them, but we go there and we have these uh, sampling and selling nice. events, and we donate a portion to whatever organization, like St. Jude's or Children Home Hunger, um, No Kid Hunger. Okay. So we do that. Um, so we got a new flavor coming. We got a couple other surprises. We do cake pops too, but we only do it for Williams Sonoma because the stores um, only have the slices. So okay. you'll see our cakes in the. Uh, what uh, Sunoco mini mark? Here's a list of them here. This is not all the list. Okay, let's, this let me is see a this. list. Let me see this. Yes. IGA, uh, Murray Market, Williams Sonoma, mm -hmm. uh, Cherry Hill. Oh, Williams Cherry Sonoma, Hill. Cherry okay, Hill. Cherry Hill Mall. Mm -hmm. Williams Sonoma Christian Mall. Williams Sonoma King uh, Pressure Mall. Mm -hmm. uh, My Blue Heaven. Cedar Brook Mall. Cedar Brook Mall. Forty mm -hmm. Street Stop Market. Mm -hmm. Um. A and A Deli, Fifty First and Haverford, yes. Golf Mini Mart, yes. Golf Mini Mart, Rising Sun, one on Old York Road, mm -hmm. one on Winfield nice. Avenue, one on Front and Spencer, yes. Luke Mini Market, Old Gaunt and Sheltonham, nice. um, Shell Mini Market, Broad and Stanton, That's Sunoco nice. Mini Market, oh, Fourth and Shelton, Sunoco Market, nice. Roosevelt Boulevard, right and more locations on the website. Yes, so right. wait a second before you go any further. Yes. I give my official stamp mm -hmm. 
<laughs> on this cake. Now, so now, <laughs> listen to this. Now, I got a little secret for you. Yes. I got a little secret for you. My 